I think there's maybe a 70% chance of you making money in Vegas. And maybe a 50% chance of you getting laid in Vegas. Huh? You know that old saying, right? What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. Don't worry. We can keep a secret. <laughs> it's all good, brah. Whatever you do in Vegas under the sheets is your own business. We ain't gonna tell shit. We ain't gonna snitch. We ain't gonna do shit. Whatever you do in Vegas is your go, brah. What's up, guys? This is Mike from Rage Break Gaming, and it's time to head through an underwater stage. No! Yes, you heard me right. Well, let's play Sonic 2 Long Version. Well, viewers, we begun the game last time. Went through Emerald Hill Zone and Chemical Plant Zone. Now we're in the dreaded Aquatic Ruin Zone. And as I already explained to you, it's part, well, it's part underwater. So don't worry, we're not going to go through the shit that was Labyrinth Zone in the first game. No, that one was pure ass. That one was pure ass. And you know what else is ass? The random ass enemies popping out of the uh, out of the side of the thing. Your movement is slowed in the water at that. And then you got these fucking Carvana bastards in this damn place. Like, bro, come on. It was already annoying with the with the water um bad nicks in the first game. Now we got this BS. And oh yeah, well luckily for us, like the first game. Shit. Shit. Wow, thank you, Tails. There you go. Yeah, you gotta get to one of those big air bubbles. Because if not, you are going to drown. And then you are going to die. Well, pretty much the same thing. You will drown and die. So, yeah. You can only afford at least maybe... I would say less than 20 seconds in the water before the timer starts going. Like, hey, bra, bra's ass. You might want to hurry up and get your ass out this fucking water. And I don't even think even the star bearer can protect your ass from getting drowned in this stage. Yeah, you thought um Mega Man NES slow down slow down effects was was crazy? <laughs> yeah, brah, nah, nah. Sonic underwater stages says hello. That being said, though, gotta get to <clears throat> shit. Sonic. Get up! No! <laughs> Bruh. Cause Sonic's slow ass couldn't get through the fucking thing. Oh, that is just BS. <sighs> you see? This shit right here. H how can you not jump over that? Makes no sense. Like I said, you gotta be quick, because if not, you will die. As I said, Ugh. get up there, Sonic. Yeah, time is really against you in the underwater stages, unfortunately, viewers. So if you're if you're a complete slow ass like I am, you'll suffer it the way I did back in the Labyrinth Zone in the first game. I mentioned the Labyrinth Zone so many times. You probably wonder why. Check the... Check my Sonic 1991 um, Let's Play that I did on the channel like a year or two ago. Yeah. Bitch, you ain't seen um Sonic Terror or Terror in the Sonic games until you play through this zone. Air Bubble, Air Bubble, SHIT! Ah! You would think I'd be able to suck on my own air bubbles, but no! Okay, I'm gonna try this one more time! If I fuck it up, then I'll have to reload my safe state. <laughs> so I already wasted a lot of lives as it is. Now, you notice that large-ass arrow that's been, like, literally stalking us at the start? These statues that are in the area here, they can, um, you know, shoot these arrows at you. And they will chase your ass on as long as they're on screen. So yeah, as long as you're on screen and that shit appears, yeah, pretty much. 
Alright. Oh, uh uh uh. Uh uh, bitch. Yeah. Go for it. Get the rate spray. Ah! Whore! Okay, stay close to the air bubble. Well, try not to die. That is. There you go. Good job, Sonic. Oh! I wasn't ready! <laughs> ready or not! Ah! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Oh! Oh, shit! Ah! Ew! You know what? Between the water and the annoying random popping up enemies and shit, it's... Bro, come on. If you think the water was annoying enough, the enemies are like, surprise, motherfucker. Fucking A. That was only Act 1! I wasted, like, two, three lives in this, in that fucking act alone. And the second act of Sonic games, especially Sonic 2, is always worse than the first. You got through the first act? Oh, you're so clever! Congratulations! You're so good! You fucked me good! No, <laughs> You fucked me really good! You fucked my stage good! Can you fuck my act good too? Yeah, pretty much. Ugh. I need an air bubble. Give me an air bubble game. Thank you. Alright, now we just have to get our ass out this water. And quickly. Ugh. And yeah, notice Tails will drown too if he if he's, you know, stuck in the water for too long. Not that it matters much. Since he's not since we're not actually controlling him per se. He's literally just there. <laughs> well, I'm not just here. I'm droning too. Yeah, we know. We see. Give me an air bubble, please. Thank you. All right. Now, we got to get out of this place. You see, I wish this was like the Mega Man games in which... Oh, shit. Whoa. Whoa, that was close. They lost four arrows at the same exact time. That is crazy. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Ah. <sighs> Fucking A. Alright. I gotta get up there. Ah. What makes it worse is that with, it being, with us being so slow in the water, it doesn't make the shit easier. It just makes it harder. And like I said, you only get like less than 20 seconds or so to get your ass out the water. And then the bubbles spawn slowly as well. So, that being the case. Uh, if only there was something we could use to help us get through this place a little bit faster. What the hell? Did this just... Hmm. Oh, shit! Bubble, 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 bubble! I didn't notice, but that thing, like, literally went down. That didn't even go down before. I don't recall ever seeing that go down. Unless that's part of this, um, this mod. Huh. Maybe a way of the modders trying to, you know, help us out a little bit. Behind the scenes. Maybe. Ah! Oh, yeah, that's so much better. Oh, yeah. Kind of sad we haven't gone through a bonus stage yet. Because of all the BS in the way. Ha! Oh man. Well, I ain't getting no Chaos Emerald this go round. Because it's time for a boss fight. Versus Dr. Eggman. In the case, Robotnik, however, this time is going for broke. Now he's all like, you know what? You fucked me up two times. I'm getting sick of this. So I'm going to smash your ass with my big ass hammer and then skewer you with the arrows. Okay? Okay. Ah! However, this this version of the fight is... This battle is such trash. I say that and yet I just lost my rings. <laughs> what you got to do is, like I'm doing now, stand on the arrows and kick that ass. Your big ass... Hammer was no match for my spinny blades of my back hair. Yeah. 
The only one who's getting his bag blown out is you, Eggman. And I'm not talking about on the frying pan. <laughs> this stage was absolute... Well, no. I was about to say absolute hell. But no. That wouldn't be the correct um, thing for... Ooh! We in Vegas, bitch! Yes! Casino Night Zone. This stage... Unlike the Nightmare Fuel that is Aquatic Ruin, this stage is in my memory books for all time this is that this is one of those specific stages in the sonic games that no matter how old you get no matter how old the game becomes this is one stage you could never ever forget especially if you're a fan of well not gambling but especially if you're a fan of vegas like i am so there you go <laughs> shout out to my viewers in vegas i love you now, here's the thing. With Casino Night Zone, we got these little bouncy thingies up there. You see those little big-ass red triangle things? Or rectangular triangle thingies? Yeah, watch out for those. What the fuck is this? That's a weird-ass bad nick. Shit, don't crush me! Ah! There you go. <laughs> Hopefully I can get into a bonus stage with this, with this zone, unlike Aquatic Ruin. Luckily, since this is a casino zone, per se, um, per se, um, yeah, here's the thing. Wait, Miles? Oh, yeah, that's right, Miles is, uh, Tails is, uh, is that, I think that's Tails' actual name. I think Tails is just a nickname, or something like that, or if that, or, or, or maybe I'm misconstruing it. I don't know, fuck me. That being said... Ah! <laughs> you said fuck me? <laughs> I didn't mean crush me, fuck me. Fuck. Ah, man. I want to do all that BS in, in the Aquatic Ruin Zone. I don't want to go... Oh, shit. I don't want to go through BS in this zone. I don't. Especially since this zone has so many memories for me. I remember this zone so many times playing it back in the day. Getting my ass kicked while having while gambling on the slot machines here. Getting Robotniks on my slot machines. It's oh yeah. You thought the slot machines in, in Gen 1 and 2 uh, or Gen 1 through 3's game corners and the Pokemon games were, were terrible? Yeah. If you if you have really terrible luck with Gambling in general <laughs> This stage is not for you ah! Oh, okay, there you go Yoink! But yeah, you should be able to get to the bonus stage in this particular zone Especially since it helps you out with your score points as well as netting you some um some extra rings So this is probably the best zone in the game to be stacking up your 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 score level, and you know stacking up those bling blings. If only I could have gotten to the bonus. I probably should have got that ring box before hitting that that checkpoint. I probably could have gotten to the bonus stage already. All right, now with this, you gotta press the down button, right? Press the action button. Ah! And then shoot your ass up in the air. So there you go. Pretty cool that way. All right, another star battery. I forget. Do the star barriers actually prevent you from, you know, getting crushed to death? I mean, I know they prevent you from getting instant death from spikes, but I don't remember if they helps you to, you know, <laughs> 69 rings. If it helps you to pre prevent you from getting crushed. Whew. If that is the case, that'd be cool. <sighs> Sorry, viewers. My brain is still focused on the aquatic ruin while I know we're trying to have a good time and, you know, hit the, um, you know, hit the casino, hit the gay strip club, or a strip club for my other viewers, you know, trying to get that, um, that back room B and D. You get it? Yeah, that's how Vegas is, you know? You're guaranteed to probably, well, well, I think there's maybe a 70% chance of you making money in Vegas. And maybe a 
50% chance of you getting laid in Vegas? Huh? You know that old saying, right? What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. Don't worry, we can keep a secret. <laughs> it's all good, brah. Whatever you do in Vegas under the sheets is your own business. We ain't gonna tell shit. We ain't gonna snitch. We ain't gonna do shit. Whatever you do in Vegas is your go, brah. And brah's ass. So yeah, get that, get that dick, get that for JJ and stuff like that. Whatever, whatever you like shoved into you or putting into someone. Yeah. <laughs> like I said, that's how Vegas is. Guarantee someone to get rich and guarantee someone to ah, get those cheeks clapped. It's my turn. Or clap some cheeks. Whichever you want to do. Yoink! <laughs> now, we get to the annoying section of Act 2. We got all the fucking bouncy pins and shit. And I got a lot of rings. So, there's, I think there's like a two more checkpoints left. If I can get to that last checkpoint, I should be able to get into the, um, the bonus stage. At least attempt to get into the Chaos Emerald. Yoink! Nice. All right. Ah! Okay, here. Okay, I remember this section. Yeah, you gotta be really careful with this part, cause if you if you go too slow, you will not make it through that part. You'll just keep on bouncing on this BS. <laughs> bouncing on it. Yeah. Bounce on it. Shake that ass. <clears throat> yeah. Bounce. All right. Almost there. Move, bitch. <laughs> I'm trying not to go too fast, because I know that I... All right, wait a minute. Don't hit it yet. I need the save state. All right, viewers, I'm back. All right, let's see if I can get to the bonus stage. Go back. There you go. All right. Kind of got to perplex it just a little bit. All right, let's try and get a Chaos Emerald. Tails, please don't screw this up for me. I really want to try to get more than just one Chaos Emerald. Trust me, you're pretty much guaranteed to get the Chaos Emerald in the Emerald Hill Zone. And stuff like that, unless you totally suck ass. <laughs> I say that yet, I know I suck ass at getting these rings. But make sure you maintain them, because you know those bombs are coming up, right? Now we gotta get 100 rings. Can you do it? Yeah, you see? I was prepared because I know those bombs. I know some of the stage layouts from some of the bonus stages. Because I knew those bombs were going to be in the way. <laughs> right at the get go. And you need to have perfect coordination with your movements with Tails and Sonic. Otherwise, ah, you will not win. So there you go. Perfect. Alright, now we got to get 140 rings. The heat is on. Ah. And yeah, it gets more what? It gets more wilder as we go through. Quickly now. Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh! Come on, come on, come on! Oh! oh yeah, there's no way I'm getting that Chaos Emerald now. I fucked myself. No! Bruh. Now, I can't completely blame Tails there. Because I literally fucked up. I literally fucked up at that spot. I blame myself for that, so I'm not going to shit on Tails for it. But still, I'm 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 still pissed off. <laughs> I almost had it. But then the bombs have to come and fuck me up. You know what's going to fuck you up even more? This boss fight versus Dr. Eggman. Now here's the thing, Eggman this time around ain't playing no game. What he's gonna do is he's gonna throw these these red spike ball thingies. I think we saw those red spike balls in the first game. I think it was the boss fight in Starlight Zone, if memory serves. Starlight, Star Bright! Ah! Yeah, don't get don't get, you know, hooked in by those pincers. Hence, hence. Ah! Cause it won't end well for you! <laughs> Careful. Oh! Tails, I kind of need you to stop fucking around and to give me a hand. You know, that would be super serial. Ugh. Come on! Almost! 
ghost! mid-level boss fights that are really annoying as fuck, but we got it. We got it. Didn't get the Chaos Emerald, but I had a good time in Vegas. Remember, viewers, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. Yeah. So is my loss of getting that Chaos Emerald. But don't worry, we had a good time in Vegas. I hope you got laid. <laughs> in any case, Hilltop Zone. Oh, and this stage is extremely extremely annoying for very obvious reasons. We're up in the fucking air. But what awaits us through Hilltop Zone? Find out next time. You guys enjoy it, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for gaming videos from me. And of course, when you subscribe, be sure to hit the bell to notify my newest uploads. Got something to say? Of course you do. Leave a comment, duh. Till next time, dudes and dudettes, my phrase break gaming, hope your rage breaks. Have a great day, my bitches and bros. Smell you later.